Welcome back to Bravo Breaking News. I am your host, Kim, aka Bravo Breaking News on Instagram. And in case you missed it, the preview for this week's Real Housewives of Beverly Hills reunion, part one, revealed that Dorit is leaking some text messages from Kyle Richards. We did a video about this a couple days ago, but since we released that, shit has hit the fan because it is spreading everywhere. There are theories going around as to what's going on with Dorit and Kyle, and we even have the one and only Bethany Frankel weighing in on it all. So I'm going to break down all of the theories and all of the breaking headlines that you need to know. But before I dive in, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any Bravo breaking news. So in case you missed it, the preview for this week's reunion part one did reveal Dorit leaking some text messages from Kyle that Kyle had sent to her the day prior to the reunion. And Dorit basically feels like she is being silenced. Now, if you guys did miss the text messages, make sure you watch my other video. I will link it here above. But it seems to have created a shitstorm, to say the least, all over social media. And that is beginning with Bethany Frankel, because we know if something happens in the Bravo world, Bethany Frankel's going to talk about it. And I don't know if she has a point with this one, but let's watch her latest TikTok video. Wow, Bethany, wow. I cannot believe a private, personal, emotional, heartfelt, guttural text from Kyle to a friend off camera when not working, when not filming, was aired. What a violation. I cannot imagine what that would feel like. Like months later, you're watching a show because you get it like a week before and you're like, oh my God. And then imagine you're thinking like, oh my God, what else have I texted that person? Like, where are the other monsters? I mean, that's a private space to text to Instagram. And if you can't do that with your friends, I, I can't imagine what, I mean, that's insane. But for the production company and the network to air a private interaction, like when you're working, you're working and that's vile enough. But like when you're not working and you're off the clock, like, are they going to also own your thoughts? That's a private text. That's insane. And Kyle is their favorite. Imagine how they treat their least favorites. Whoa. So she is basically saying that she is appalled that Dorit would do this to Kyle. Leak personal text messages that were not meant to go on air and were sent after filming had wrapped. She's even calling out production for letting this actually happen, saying that it's a violation of privacy and that they should get in trouble. Of course, she ends the video saying that Kyle's their favorite. So if they were to do this to Kyle, what would they do to their least favorite castmates? Now, I don't really know if her stance has legs at this point because let's be real, these women are on a reality show, they are about to film a reunion, and Kyle does send this long text to Dorit the day before, specifying exactly what she wants to and doesn't want to talk about on the reunion stage. It almost seems as if Bethany is trying to recruit Kyle to come into her failed reality reckoning and kind of turn against Bravo. We do know that Bethany and Kyle do have a long-standing friendship. They've been friends for years, decades, even before Real Housewives was even a thing. So will Bethany sway Kyle in that direction? I'm not sure. I mean, Kyle was on Watch What Happens Live this week. She definitely does have a good relationship with the network, so I doubt that anything will come from this. But will Kyle make an appearance on Bethany's podcast? Now that is an interesting theory. But Bethany isn't the only one talking about this because there are a lot of tweets going around. One specifically that is kind of blowing my mind. The Bravo Babe on Twitter has reported that Word on the street, Kyle is done with her friendship with Dorit after she found out about Dorit showing her text message at the reunion. So this is actually kind of shocking because it kind of seems like they did make up at the reunion. We did learn on the finale that Kyle and Dorit basically didn't talk for several months. Kyle was ignoring Dorit up until the reunion that day before when she sent that long text. Kyle has also said that Dorit has exaggerated their friendship and that they really weren't that good of friends to begin with, which has to hurt for Dorit because from a viewer's perspective, they did seem like best friends. But this has me wondering, did Dorit not disclose that she shared Kyle's text message backstage? In the clip, we see Dorit showing it to Erica during Glam ahead of filming the reunion. We do not see her bring it up on stage. We do not see Kyle reacting directly to that. 
So did Kyle find out about this leaked text message the same way we did in the preview for the upcoming part one? That is almost what it seems like because we saw Dorit, Kyle, PK, and Mauricio at a family friend's bar mitzvah just, I think, maybe two weeks ago at this point, having fun, dancing. Yes, I feel like that is a situation where they could set their differences aside and have a good time, but they did seem to be in cahoots. So that makes me wonder if Kyle knew about this leaked text message before it actually leaked online. More recently, when Kyle was on Watch What Happens Live, she was playing a game titled Battle of the Besties, where she was answering questions about Sutton and Dorit. And when she was asked who she trusted the least, she answered both. That means at some point between the reunion, up until last week when she filmed Watch What Happens Live, something happened. Now, of course, fans are speculating about this because a few months ago, there was a lot of chatter about Dorit and Mauricio. You know, we've all seen the clips from Beverly Hills of them maybe getting a little too cozy. We have the viral image of Dorit kissing Mauricio's shoulder after she went over to their house and told them about the break-in. I didn't really think much of it. But fans are speculating that Kyle's cliffhanger from the finale when she revealed that Mauricio did something that did break her trust has to do with Dorit. Now, I don't know if I believe this. I don't think that Dorit would do something with Mauricio. I think if she did, we would have heard about it. I think that there would be a lot bigger issues in both of their marriages. And I think it's something that is too big to not get leaked or get out in some way. So I don't know if there are legs to that theory, but a lot of people are talking about it and fans are speculating that that is one of the bombshells that Kyle is going to drop at the reunion. And is Dorit leaking the text message kind of payback? I don't know. There are a lot of rumors swirling, but I do hope we get answers during part one of the reunion because we know that Bravo does tend to share the juicy details till part three. But revealing this text ahead of part one, I know that they're going to confront it during part one of this week's reunion. And honestly, I could not be more excited. While we did have a pretty good season of Beverly Hills, you know, it wasn't the most dramatic. We did get a glimpse into Kyle and Mauricio's relationship, a little bit into Dorit and PK's. But honestly, all of the drama really happened in the final episode. But I do have a feeling that this reunion is going to be one of the most dramatic that we have seen especially following last year's. Now, what do you guys think? Do you think something is up with Dorit and Mauricio? What do you think Kyle's reunion bombshell is going to be? Do you think that Dorit is leaking this text just to draw up a storyline for next season? Let's be real, she didn't have much to bring this season other than her relationship with PK. And while they still seem to be having a little bit of trouble, they do seem to be reconciling things and moving forward. So will we be seeing the battle between Kyle and Dorit continue on next season of Beverly Hills? Is this going to secure Dorit's diamond for next season? Drop your theories and comments below and make sure you guys subscribe so you don't miss any more Bravo breaking news.